Good evening, thanks for joining us. Tonight's big story, look at this, a coyote attack caught on camera. Home surveillance cameras show the animal leap over a wall to go after someone's dog. Thankfully, the little guy was able to get away just in time, but that coyote, as you can see, was determined to get that dog. It's really scary if you have a small dog. Team 12's Mitch Carr talked to the family who never thought that their pet would become prey in their own backyard. We were getting ready to go to bed last weekend and right after midnight, we let him out so he could do his thing. All of a sudden we just heard him screeching. <laughs> and before you knew it, he ran inside the door and we saw a dog or something jump over the wall. The something that Jerry Dempsey saw was a coyote. His dog, Buddy, got away unharmed. We looked him over afterwards, and we didn't see no visible injuries or anything like that. Dempsey doesn't live out in the country. He lives in a well-developed part of Mesa near Power and Brown. But this coyote still came for Buddy, easily jumping a six-foot wall to do so. I've heard of him, but I, it just never occurred that it would happen at our house. And um, you just got to be outside with your dogs all the time. Suddenly, they've learned how to go live in the cities and start preying on domestic pets. Paul Mott's dog, Buffy, was not as lucky as Buddy. Well, unfortunately, my dog was killed uh, several years ago, and uh, I didn't realize uh, how dangerous coyotes were at the time. He was heartbroken, and he got to work inventing something that would protect his other two dogs, and the coyote vest was born. We're trying to scare him away with an uh, intimidating look. So we added these things we call coyote whiskers, which are just bright, shiny bristles on the top of your dog's back. And it definitely makes them look like they just got off the set of a Mad Max movie. Mott has been selling the vests for more than five years. And it gives you that moment that I wish I would have had with Buffy to spin around and scare the coyote away before, you know, your dog is seriously injured or killed. Jerry Dempsey says he may soon be one of Paul Mott's customers. If it's the right color combination, I wouldn't mind. Mitch Carr, 12 News. All right, Mitch, thanks.